One of the reports available to manage sales activity is the sales forecast report. Here, they have the sales activity for each team member broken out into the various stages of the sales process. They can see how many leads they are working, how many have progressed to opportunities, and how many have become quotes. They may also view the various stages of their pipeline to see the expected revenue from these quotes as well. To begin their research, they want to know what other quotes Scott may have that are stalled and why. To do that, they're going to drill down on all of his quotes and select a pivot table. Then they're going to add the field reason description as a filter. When they do this, the pivot table is updated to show each reason description and the number of quotes associated with it. Among the usual reasons, there are several quotes that have been labeled cannot meet delivery date. This is cause for concern, so an immediate investigation of these quotes is in order. Fortunately, with Excel Connect, the data is already at their disposal. By clicking the result, a list of the corresponding records is immediately opened and ready for review. The first thing that they would like to do is find out what parts are being quoted. By selecting those quote numbers and pasting them below, they can use Excel Connect's query tool to build an ad hoc function that will pull a list of the parts that are on each of these quotes. Utilizing one of the many available data sets, they can pull up-to-date information from their Epicor system and place it directly into their Excel spreadsheet. Once the function is completed, a list of the parts on each quote is returned. Rather than taking the time to investigate each part separately, they decide to prioritize the parts by finding out how much revenue is expected for each one. Another function is quickly created and added to the table. Suddenly, they discover that quotes containing these two parts represent a very large amount of revenue. Drilling down to a pivot table filters the result even further and shows that a majority of that revenue is associated with part number DCD200ML. A quick call to the sales rep reveals that, in the case of these quotes, the customers were needing lead times of typically four to five weeks, which they were unable to meet. The sales director sends an email to the engineering project manager to find out what is going on with this particular part that is delaying these quotes.